Yo, what up you guys, Magic IQ here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new build on the 488 GTB. Now, as you guys know, in Volume 2, you can switch cars in every single playlist. You can switch in between races and choose the most viable car for that track. Now, this is another one of those short track, beautiful, I mean quick, very, very efficient, very high horsepower cars that is very dominant on a track like Blue Collar. This thing will put down sub twos very easily. This thing's an absolute beast, as you guys saw from the gameplay. The 488 GTB is now a force to be reckoned with in the S Class. Pre-update, it really wasn't as viable because of the top speed limitations. With RevTech, you can get up to 170, but the top speed on paper is 162. Without having to rev tech, you can still get it to like 165. 0 to 60 is 2.2. Horsepower is 967. And max torque is 893. Quarter mile time of 9.5. We have optimized this build to be as efficient with the most needed horsepower. So just because somebody's viewer requested video has the most horsepower available does not mean it's always the best. So make sure you guys tap into why the car has the power number that it does. But I'm going to show you all those builds today in case somebody happens to view or request the video uh, just randomly right after somebody else does it because that's not a coincidence at all. So as you guys see here in the engine parts, first let's go over the motor though. We're using a 6.4 liter V8 in this car. I have done some testing with the other motors and we're still diving deep into this thing because we think it has even more potential as a drift build. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But in the parts here, we got a pro induction, Elite ECU, Elite Fuel System, Elite Exhaust, and a Super Roots Supercharger. Now we have Elite Road Suspension here and Elite Off-Road Tires. I know that looks like a crazy combo right there, but trust me, you don't even feel the difference. And this thing still grips like crazy on the road and grips even better on the dirt with this combo. It's a very balanced setup. Now this is the six speed build for this car. Now if you guys were to build this car for a five speed, all you would do is go ahead and put this transmission in it go over to the forced induction and what you would do here is you'd put the elite root supercharger which is going to bring you up to around 1039 955 what i'm going to do here is bring this all the way up to an elite induction and drop this exhaust down to super and what that's going to do with one very small tweak here we're going to go down to super off-road tires to bring us down to 329 that's going to give us even more power but you have a lower top speed and trust me that 162 is very very needed when going over the hill on blue collar with the testing that you guys actually do you'll realize that even though this has the superior power numbers and is a very viable option too the other build i think is just a tad bit better but i wanted to give you guys both options in one video so you guys could really figure out what you prefer for your specific play style this one will lack in top speed a little bit topping off around 162 
and not being able to rev tech any further than 65 but the extra six seven miles per hour i believe is a little bit more viable because you are able to get to that top speed just as fast now the grip and drift are our nitrous auxiliaries here as always those don't really change very often on every build the handling here on both of these builds is going to be 100 percent grip and 100 percent to the right high down force steering sensitivity is right in the middle for me personally you guys can adjust that based on your personal preference trash control is set to completely off and drift entry is brake tap also have a couple other alternative builds with grip tires man so let's go ahead and take a look at them right here this is a grip tire build with 958 horsepower 889 max torque and you also have that 161 top speed that we we're looking for so this is if you don't want the off-road tires you want a little bit more grip on tarmac the only difference is your top speed is going to fall off when you go over that hill on blue collar so this might be better for a track like smoke show possibly if you guys prefer it there the induction is the only thing that's going to change here we're going to go all the way down to a sport induction as well as the exhaust is going to be pro instead of what it is which is super on one of the builds so pro exhaust and sport induction on this elite grip tire and elite road suspension build with the six speed so i hope i've given you guys enough options with this amazing car the build used in the gameplay that you guys saw at the beginning was the first build I showed you guys with the 162 top speed with 967 horsepower and 893 foot pounds of torque that I showed you guys at the beginning of this breakdown. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one and I'm out. Peace.